Hi and welcome to this quick tutorial on how to export from 3ds Max, import into Blender, and bake the normal maps in Blender. Now the main reason you want to do this is because it's a pain to bake normal maps in Blender and pretty much any type of maps. Uh, I don't like doing it, so if I had the choice I would bake them in Blender. So I have a simple scene here. It is a low poly cube with nothing on it, just a normal cube, and a cube with this little bump on it. Nothing that special. Um, on the low poly cube, I have a UVW map. Um, as you can see, it's just a simple kind of cube shape. And now that's all you need, you can export it. So go up here, hit export, and I'm gonna save this as normal scene, and I'm gonna make sure it's set as OBJ because that's the best to go back and forth between 3ds Max and Blender. So hit save. And yes, I want to replace this. Now, you could ignore all of these settings unless you change some weird ones. Um, but I'm just going to export and then done. Now, I'm going to head over into Blender, go File, Import, OBJ, and find Normal Scene. Now, it's going to be really big because 3ds Max has larger scale. Um, so just scale this down, it doesn't matter. UV maps. Uh, I'm hitting S by the way, I'm hitting S on the keyboard and scaling down. So UV maps don't matter how big the actual object is, just as long as the UV maps share the same coordinates, which since we didn't modify them, then I'll be okay. So I'm going to go up here to that tab and drag open a new window and hit go uh, change this to UV image editor. Now, with my low poly selected, I'm going to have to right click again to make sure low is selected down here. I'm going to hit tab, which will go into edit mode. And then I'm going to go down here to new. And I'm going to name this normal bake. And then hit OK. Now, that'll just give me a black image. Now, what I have to do is I actually have to go up here. Well, for me, I have to go up here and change this to blender render. Make sure that's set. And then I have to, when I'm back into edit mode, I have to go down here and select normal bake if I switched. If I was already in Blender, I wouldn't have to switch. So now that that's set, we can go back into object mode by hitting tab again, going over to the render tab, going down to bake, change this to normal, where's normal, normals, and then tick select to be active. Now the way you want to do this is you want to click the high poly and then shift click the low poly mesh and hit bake. And that's all you need to do. Easy as that. Your image is baked. If you want to save this, save as image, you go to desktop. The name's already there, normal bake. If you want to save it as a different file type, you can go down here to PNG or Targa, whatever you want, and then hit save. And now when you import this back into 3ds Max, because we didn't change the UVs at all, it'll work all the same, and you won't run into any problems. I hope you learned something from this tutorial. Sorry it was kind of quick. I'm mainly designing this to help someone um, specific, not really a general tutorial, but I thought I would upload it to YouTube anyways.